There's the camp. Sira. Not what I expected. These ruins look old. I wonder who built them and when. What are those towers? Nothing but that tablet. I wonder what it says. So the light beams are the key. It's locked. I should check the tablet again. Aligned. to be in the right position.
Something's blocking this. Something's in the way. <clears throat> Won't budge. <clears throat> Something's in the way. That should work. Now to try the door. Finally. Now we need to find what lies within. Why would my father be here? should watch my step.
What is this place? Time to take a dive. Hello? Icarus! <laughs> Traitor. Greetings, Cassandra. Welcome to Atlantis. Atlantis? Impossible! I thought it was just a myth. There are many secrets in this world that are hidden behind myth and legend. And who are you? My name is Pythagoras. I'm your father. Pythagoras? That doesn't make any sense. He died decades ago. Yes. Almost a century if memory serves. And yet, here I am. Standing before you. And Icarus is... My oldest and dearest friend. I sent him to watch over you. And now... Here you are. I've come to fulfill my destiny. Oh, you have? And what would that be, young one? I was hoping you'd tell me. Atlantis does not give up its secrets easily. Why was I sent here? What's my role in all of this? I want answers! There is knowledge in this place. Powerful knowledge. In their own hands, its secrets could bring about the downfall of humanity. We cannot allow others to discover this place. We must find a way to seal it from the world forever. I don't understand any of this. I'm a warrior, not a scholar. We all have a purpose, Cassandra. Yours was to help me protect the secrets of Atlantis. You're right. We must save the Greek world from itself. Above all things, trust yourself. You're capable of greatness. I'll do my best. The answers I seek are behind these mechanisms. They are sealed, and the artifacts to open them are missing. So, I need to find the artifacts and return them to Atlantis. I've collected information that hints at where these artifacts may be located. However, they are incredibly powerful. They corrupt the minds of lesser people and possess a will to defend themselves. I'll bring them back. But I still have questions for you. And I have answers. For now, though, take this. It's part of a key to access an artifact that is hidden in Viotia. I have an ally trying to find the second half as we speak. <laughs> We found Atlantis! Atlantis? Let me check your vitals. You're delirious! We've been searching for an Isu artifact with reality-bending powers, and this bothers you? 
Pythagoras was born around 570 BCE. That would make the man in that cave nearly 150 years old. What could possibly be keeping him alive? The staff of Hermes Trismegistus. Mrs. San, you were right. I'll help you pack up the gear. Thanks. Let's roll out. I've reached the coordinates. The series of caves we detected should be right under me. My equipment's ready. Preparing to dive. Layla, you have no idea what's down there. There could be sharks. I prefer that to Templars. We'll keep an eye out for Abstabo. Good luck, Layla. Thanks. I'm heading down now. There has to be a way in. I'll find it. There! That must be the way in. Are you all still reading me? It's awfully quiet on comms. We hear you, Layla. Thanks. It's just so silent down here. You're not alone, Layla. We're monitoring your progress. You're doing fine. Yeah, we're here if you need us. Set the assassin sitting at the desk. Well, I don't have to be on a boat to be useful. I have loads of information on ancient Greece. Did you know that at Zakros, the Minoans built a graveyard so huge it was known as the Ravine of the Dead? Can we please not talk about death? Elena, promise me that if I die down here, you'll rename this place the Caves of the Dead. I'm on it. People! I'm gonna miss the London Loft. I really like the view. Miss it? Why can't you go back? Didn't you read Kyoshi's report? Abstergo's already swept through it. It's compromised. No, I've been busy researching Theta. Kyoshi, are you alright? Of course. After clearing out the last of our gear, I observed the infiltration from a distance. Did they pick up the present I left? Yes, they found the USB key you dropped under the desk. Nice tactic. No one at Abstergo will be stupid enough to stick that in a computer. They don't have to. It's a shell holding one of my special RFID transmitters. Get it anywhere near workstation, like, say, in the head of security's office, and boom. Impressive. All in a day's hack. Wow. It's more elaborate than I could have imagined. How did they build all this? What I wouldn't pay for an Isu toolbox. different from Egypt. Some aesthetic elements in common, but... Mm -hmm. I should get out of this diving suit before I start exploring. It's real. I made it. Layla to Altair 2? I'm in. Do you have visuals? Yes! By the gods, Layla, it's Atlantis! How are you feeling? Any nausea from the pressure change? No, I'm fine. These rooms are... amazing. Think, Layla, think! must be a way. Something has to power up this place. 
I'm re-entering the Animus. I need Cassandra to show me how she got farther inside. Ride, Phobos! Talk to him. Let's go. <laughs> he must be the one Pythagoras mentioned. The layer of the Sphinx. Impressive. Oh my, Amistios. What are you doing here? My name is Gorgias, and I have spent my life researching the past of Viotia and the Peloponnese. I'm looking for the other half of this amulet. Ah, yes, I know of items like this. I was seeking a piece similar in size. Where is it? Unfortunately, my apprentice was the one tracking down its final location in Locris. He went to retrieve it, but never returned. I will do everything I can to find your missing apprentice. I appreciate the help, Mistios. I am very worried about my pivos. Where was your apprentice heading? We heard rumors of a sighting near the tomb of Menikefs in Viotia. What was Pibos looking for? There was a cave discovered that might contain items of great significance. I sent him to validate the claims before I made the journey myself. Don't worry. I'll find out what happened to Pibos. Let's go. <laughs> He's over there.
This must be Pibos. Or what's left of him. The creature that killed Pibos must have eaten the amulet. Together perfectly. This must be the key. Come on. <laughs> the statue, it's gone. Another challenger. I hope you're more resilient than the last one. By the gods! The statue came alive! I am no statue, child. If you cannot comprehend what stands before you, how are you to entertain me? What are you? The Sphinx. The guardian of truth and knowledge. Why are you here? The gods sent me to protect something, and I've been its guardian ever since. I came here for another reason. Oh, then tell me, little one, why are you here? You protect an object of great power. I have been asked to return it to where it belongs. A most noble of causes. Sadly, I cannot grant your request. There's too much at stake. I won't leave without it. The power I guard is not for the weak-willed. I can resist. One must risk everything in the pursuit of knowledge. If you can answer my questions wisely, you will have proven yourself worthy. What can run but never walks? Has a mouth but never talks? Has a head but never weeps? Has a bed but never sleeps. A river. That could be. I'm alive, but without breath. I'm as cold in life as in death. 
I'm never thirsty, though I always drink. You're a fish. You're highly perceptive. At night they come without being fetched. And by day, they are lost without being stolen. The stars. You're a wise one. You are an interesting one. Now, take what you have learned and touch the symbols that reflect your choices. <laughs> 